Hey guys, how's it going? So in this tutorial, I'll be showing you guys how to install Jmol, which is again a really powerful um, molecular visualization program and can be used to even, you know, um, visualize uh, the isosurfaces such as molecular orbitals, densities, etc. And it is really powerful as it also allows you scripting. So therefore, you can, you know, perform a lot of actions uh, just by writing a simple script. So in order to install it, just launch your web browser on your Linux or Ubuntu PC and then search for jmol and head over to their homepage so this is the you know homepage of jmol jmol.sourceforge.net and head over to the download page and then go ahead and click on download latest version so it is around 72 megabytes and i already have it downloaded so i'll you know not download it again but in your case you can go ahead and save the file in my case i already have it here in my downloads folder so I won't be downloading it again. So this is the you know jmol binary dot zip package that we downloaded, and then you will go ahead and right click on it and click extract here and get this directory. So I'll just show you once again by just deleting it, All right? And then we'll once again right click on the downloaded you know zip package and click extract here. So here it is. Now if you go ahead and open it then you'll notice that it has a lot of files and the most important file that basically is jmol is this jmol.jar so jmol.jar is the you know uh, the application or the executable file but if you go ahead and double click on it then if you don't have java installed then it will just not work and you know you will see the contents uh, within this um, you know executable file so in order to get this to run what you need to do is you need to go ahead and open the terminal and make sure that you're connected to the internet and install java by giving the command sudo apt get install default or hyphen jre and then hit enter and enter your password and then just click on yes to install it so as you can see it's around 37 megabytes so just wait for the installation to complete and then once the installation is complete then go ahead and go back to the jmol directory that you extracted and double click on the jmol.jar file now as you can notice right now it runs but you know you're you're seeing an error and that is probably because you know we haven't made jmol.jar into an executable file so again you will have to come back to the terminal and i'll just go ahead and clear the terminal to make it more concise and then change the directory in your within your terminal and go to the directory where you inst or extracted jmol in so i extracted jmol within this directory so yeah so here now we can see the contents of the jmol directory so what we are going to do is we are going to convert the jmol.jar file into a, an executable file so in order to do that we'll give the command chmod u plus x and then um, the jmol.jar file like this um, remove these okay so this is weird um, it says that it cannot access the jmol.jar ah okay so I entered the name wrong it's actually a, an uppercase j over here yeah now if you hit enter then that basically means that your jmol.jar file is now an executable so now if you come back to the directory double click on it then it will launch jmol and voila here is your jmol and another way to you know um, launch jmol can be to use like java jar and then jmol.jar yeah and as you can see this also opens or runs jmol using the terminal so in this case you will also be able to see all the you know I uh, command line uh, you know um, statements when you're running jmol so here it is that's it so that's how you download and install jmol on a Linux in particular Ubuntu PC using Java so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and in case you did then don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Thanks for watching and have a great day.